What is up guys, Tony Tome back again for another review. So today I'm going to be reviewing another uh, vitamin water. This is the Power C Dragon Fruit flavor. Flavored with, it says flavored plus other natural flavors. Okay, that's random. Um, let's see, nutrition facts. 120 calories. Uh... Carbohydrates, 32 grams. Sugars, 32 grams. And then the uh, vitamin profile, it has 150% of your daily vitamin C, 100% of your B12, 100 of B6 and pantothenic acid, and 25% zinc. And an ungodly amount of magnesium, because it has that little cross. So, <laughs> And 25% of chromium which I don't know where else you're going to get chromium. So, But, you know, I've never had anything dragon fruit, so I thought I'd give it a try. If I can get the bottle open. Let's give it a smell. Hmm. Kind of smells like a mix between, like, mango and cranberry. So let's give it a try. Hmm. Yeah. That's exactly what it is. It's like mango cranberry. It's got the sweetness of mango, with and it has the flavor of cranberry, but it doesn't have that bitterness at the end, which I kind of like that it doesn't have that. I'm, I'm not a fan of how bitter cranberries are. And when you get those cranberry, like ocean spray, it has so much sugar that the cranberry just, it basically, you know, it does nothing. So it's like, this is actually really good. It's really good. Oh, so it says here, ingredients, reverse osmosis water, crystalline fructose, cane sugar, less than half percent of vitamin C, citric acid, natural flavors, dragon fruit extract, vegetable juice for color, uh, magnesium lactate and calcium lactate and potassium phosphate uh, taurine vitamin B5 zinc gluconate vitamin B6 and B12 and chromium polynicotate whatever that is some of these names are just like who cares <laughs> it's like you can't even pronounce them but uh, let's give it another try, and I'll give you my rating. Uh, mm. Yeah. Okay. So, and the reason I'm doing this is I'm starting a cut next week. And I was telling one of my subscribers this. I'm doing like a between a six to an eight week cut. And then I'm going to finish it off with the uh, my ultimate cheat day challenge, which I've been promising for like a year but I just haven't gotten around to it. But, it, you know, it's just one thing after another. I get sick or, you know, I lose my job, and those things are really expensive. I mean, I know some guys that spend, you know, two to 300 bucks on that thing, and I don't have that kind of money. But um, I'm doing a cut, so I'm doing a bunch of these reviews. I just went to Target today, and I got, like, I spent, like, $15 on different vitamin waters and sparkling ice waters and I did get an energy drink I got this the Rockstar Organic Energy I'll be reviewing that either tomorrow or Friday because I'm going to the gym both days so I gotta wake up and have some energy but I'm gonna be doing a cut so I'm getting used to drinking a lot of water so I've been I bought a lot of these just to ease me into it because you know i'll drink about half of this and then fill it up with the water and all that so uh yeah what do you guys think of the uh, vitamin water dragon fruit do you got do you guys like it did i rate it no i didn't um i'll give it a three and a half it's not the best vitamin water i've had i've had quite a few and i would say this is my least favorite but uh it's definitely not bad it's just I don't think I would go back to it because there are so many other ones that I like better. But, uh, yeah. Uh, what do you guys think of the Dragon Fruit Vitamin Water? Let me know in the comments below. And also, leave me suggestions for 
uh, the uh, my cheat day challenge, but don't put anything that's dairy. Like, don't say, oh, eat a whole Supreme pizza or eat a whole gallon of ice cream. Because I can't do that because I have an allergy to dairy. So anything with high pro like high dairy protein in it makes me like makes my throat itch and all that stuff so i can't really do that so uh you know just but leave comments below and i will see what i can do and i will see you guys in the next review see you later peace